Hey troops, how are you? I have a busy day, but real quick, let me just say welcome, welcome, welcome. Um, <clears throat> I will be back later. It is it is Tuesday. I almost said Monday. Um, <clears throat> but let's do let's do a quick one. Not not a whole story, but uh, let's see what we get for current current energy. Ooh, that flew out. Son of Pence. Two cups. The, you know, it's ironic because the Son of Pence talks about a new start. It's like the opportunity was already given, it's here. Normally it talks about financial, and it still could, even though the two of cups is next to it, like happy, being happy about it, right? But he looks sad, he looks confused <clears throat> about a connection. This could be, this could also be a teenager, you know, like, whoa, what is this? First love, all that, you know, um, current energy, please. Well, this is saying you're going to have a new situation come about, right? Four of pence. A new situation come about. Could be somebody at a distance here. Pull temperance. Healing energy, right? Balance. Fire energy. What else? Current energy. Pull one more next to temperance, and then I'll clarify. That's too many. One more current energy. Again, too many. <laughs> one more. So you do have a connection. Everyone has connections, troops. Could be dealing with the Sag, could be dealing with the Virgo. That Five of Swords keeps wanting to come out. So, <clears throat> if someone's trying to win, you could have a Sag trying to win, win you over. It's like, This is somebody that I don't think I don't think you're gonna put effort into. This is like a connection you had. And it's like saying let go. This is the past. Someone's trying to figure out what happened to the connection? Maybe somebody let go. There's a Sag energy. 
This is not reconciliation. This is not balance. This is manipulation. This, I would have to say, would be in the last two to four years. Okay, so it's like they're not even looking at the connection. Someone's just figuring it out that there's a connection that's gone. It's very delicate energy. Tell me about the Son of Pence. <clears throat> So we have the Four of Cups. Four of Cups talks about, you look at the rat. Normally I don't look at the rat like that, right? But this is, this is like Operation Get Them Back because now they realize there's not a connection. Or well, there's obviously a connection, but it, it's like somebody let go. But this, this one that's coming back is manipulating the situation. Okay, so please be aware of that. Tell me about the Two of Cups. <clears throat> you might have a lot of passion towards this person or vice versa, like, it was like a, an intense connection, but don't, don't be fooled because this person's trying to win. Tell me about the two of cups. And it's not win you over. Very manipulating energy. I haven't come across narcissism yet, but we're getting close. Okay, see, we got the world. It's a wrap. Okay. Um, the eight of wands, I keep seeing it. So you're going to get a message from the past at some point but it's over and it's not like and it's over now it must have been love it's not like that I bet you it was love infatuation temptation it was a challenge it, it sounds like something we've been reading on right and I think this person is going to be shocked that you let go Tell me about the four of pence. Judgment. So this is you guys. All damn day. This is the only card that's you. It's up to you. But it's over. I don't see growth. They're coming in as a page. They're not even coming in as a king troops. Tell me about temperance. <clears throat> you got the mother of swords and the father of cups. So you could be you could be the air sign cutting it out of your life. And this person coming at you is Pisces or Sag or Taurus Virgo Capricorn. It, it propensities don't matter. Um, the mother of swords is you guys with judgment. Because look how it's looking. Looking right at it. And look how black and white it is. There's no color. You don't see color. So, right, this person's going to come in charming. And it's like they're going to swoop in with these, these wings. They could be air because we're talking about wind. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. But this person's going to come in talking all sorts of yada, yada. Okay. Look at this person. 
just looking in this direction, not even looking at you over here, not even looking at you in here. They're just more or less like, damn, it's really over. Trust me, you're still going to get a message because this is you, totally black and white. You know, you know what the deal is here. Tell me about the Five of Swords. This is this person wanting to win. And I'm telling you, it's not, I want to win you back. It's not like that. Well, it is, but with manipulating energy. Okay. So we got the Wheel of Fortune. So it's, it's, it's like up in the air. At the bottom of the deck, you got the hangman reversed, right? So it's, it's almost saying like, to me, look at the beady eyes. But it's, it's almost saying to me like, you're not hung up anymore. You're going in a new direction. Someone didn't go through a proper transformation or is not accepting something, right? So they're just hoping something's going to go in their direction. But look at the clusterfuck of energy. <clears throat> so... I'm going to clarify the major arcana. Tell me about the world. So this is over. This is something that's done. Somebody wants to resurrect something, and it's going to be up to you. Tell me about the world, whether or not you want to. To me, you already released. That you already released. Someone's going to come at you with all sorts of stuff. So you got the, you got the Son of Swords. See what I'm saying? Coming at you, poking at you, stabbing you. Choo, choo, choo. Which is this one. Someone's probably watching you too, but tell me about judgment. This person is trying to be very strategic. Now this judgment in this mother so is as you. And again, you're still dealing with a page. Some of you need to prepare. Someone's coming back. And what judgment is the Ten of Swords. So once again, you're looking at it like it's over. Especially with the sun here. Clear as day. It's, it's over. Once again, black and white. You keep coming in black and white. Whatever this is, very, very clear cut for you. There's no confusion. You know someone's MO. Well, I'm preparing you. Because this is someone's M.O. And once again, you could be dealing with a Libra, Gemini, Aquarius. Tell me about the wheel. This talks about a new cycle, but their cycle looks awfully cluttered. Tell me about that. Because all they want to do is win. They, they want to win. They want you back in their little circle. And they're going to use try to use passion to get back at you, too, for some of you. Or others of you that come at you, come at you with some bullshit. Look at the wheel, the hierophant reversed, right? Not wanting a commitment, squawking in your ear. This one will get stuck in all that, that netting. Wouldn't be able to fly. That person doesn't hold the key to your heart anymore. Tell me about temperance. And it's ironic because that, that came out reversed. Oh, so didn't the hangman. But tell me about temperance. Because even if it was to come out this way, that would be like, they want to win, right? Temperance, chariot, moving forward, star reversed. Ace of swords reversed. There's some lies going on. Another ten of swords. That's a ten of wands. Sorry, troops. There, there's still some lies. This temperance energy that could be to, uh, Sagittarius or Aquarius is still lying. I think they feel stabbed in the back or they're going to attempt to stab you in the back. But regardless, guys, they're, they're trying to win a situation. Okay, so not a good scenario at all. Let's see what they're going to offer. <clears throat> what are they going to offer?
they're gonna offer the five of cups <laughs> you know it's like they're gonna come at you with some bullshit they're gonna come at you with stuff that was said from the past or you did this to me you, you did look at their head down like lack of confidence some will have lack of confidence or they'll come off with lack of confidence others would just be like it would be petty well you said this you said that I mean someone that's been holding a grudge for a long time or holding on to words holding on to memories you know what I mean but this looks like a big clusterfuck of no way and 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 they're coming back and it's ironic because I did a read a few months ago for you guys and it was um, one of the ones for, for purchase and I, I told the majority of you September and it's September and it, it brought me right to that read okay so be smart with this situation that will eventually come in there's no question make sure you're using your intuition you're not going back and forth you're not arguing you know, if you're down to just argue with this person and go back and forth because you once had a connection, then you're going to repeat a cycle. Okay? Your best advice for this situation. Wrap it up. Regain your balance and wrap it up. Bottom of the deck. You're not even looking in this direction. Okay? It's balance. You know, the Two of Pens, it's, it's twos, it's grounding. That's your best advice. You, you are now the butterfly. Spread your wings and fly. Right? It's the world. Wrap it up. Wrap it up. I want to clarify the world. Just so I can get a better idea about the two of pens real quick. You're about to fly in a whole nother direction. Because your first card out is the world. Wrap it up. It's over. Let the door shut. There's a new one that's going to open. If it's not already opened. To me it's... it's it's already opened. To me, you're triggering something in this person. Okay? So, you have the, the nine of wands with the world. Okay? Don't, don't give up. Use your intuition here. At the, because this offer is coming in with the page of swords. Um, they're basically saying wrap it up. Because the nine of sword, nine of sorry, the nine of wands talks about not giving up. Don't give up. You're a beautiful butterfly. Use your intuition here. Your overall message is wrap it up. So this means someone's coming back. Someone didn't close the door properly because you're one away from a ten. You did. You're already a butterfly. You're already using your intuition. You got the the world in your hand. You got the globe. You're gorgeous, right? Wrap it up is the best advice I can give you. It's going to be a little bit of a struggle because it's, it's, it's your past. There was love. It must have been love, but it's over now. It, it, wasn't, it wasn't true love. Be smart. I love you guys. I hope you have a fantastic day. I'll see you guys later.